A fire broke out in the protocol department in the state secretariat, destroying many files. And Kerala reported 2,375 fresh COVID cases on Tuesday. I'm Lakshman Priya. Welcome to the New Indian Express news updates from Kerala. A fire in the protocol department of the Kerala Secretariat on Tuesday evening, which is said to have destroyed some files, prompted the opposition parties to allege that it was part of a conspiracy to destroy evidence in the gold smuggling case. Fire and rescue personnel rushed to the spot and put out the fire. BJP State President K. Surendran, who arrived at the Secretariat along with other leaders to protest, was arrested and removed. The Kerala High Court on Tuesday dismissed the appeal filed by the Kerala government seeking to quash an earlier order allowing a CBI probe into the murder of two youth congress leaders at Peria in Kasakot, allegedly by CPM supporters. In another blow to the government, the High Court refused to issue an interim order staying further proceedings on the central government's decision to hand over the Thiruvananthapuram airport to Adani Enterprises for 50 years. The court adjourned the case to September 15 for final hearing. There was no let-up in the spread of COVID as the state on Tuesday report, reported 2,375 fresh cases. As many as 2,142 of these were due to local transmission. Worryingly, the source of infection in 174 cases could not be traced. The government also confirmed the death of 10 more people, taking the official toll to 244. Meanwhile, 1,456 people recovered from the infection in the last 24 hours. While the situation in Thiruvananthapuram seemed to be improving, there has been a steep surge in Malappuram district which is causing concern. The district-wise breakup of fresh cases is as follows. Malappuram 454, Thiruvananthapuram 391, Koriko 260, Thrissur 227, Alapura 170, Ernakulam 163, Palakkad 152, Kannur 150, Kasargod 99, Pathanandita 92, Kollam 87, Kottam 86, Vainad 37 and Iduki 6. That's all for now. For more updates, please follow our social media handles. Thank you and stay safe.